my world is a black world. She was doing something that a lot of black writers who had come up in the 70s weren't doing, which was to write about the stories without having to talk about excising whiteness. And she didn't do it in a way that was about saying that the white world was wrong. The white world was just peripheral if it existed at all. I didn't want to speak for black people. I wanted to speak to and to be among. It's us. So the first thing I had to do was to eliminate the white gaze. Jimmy Baldwin used to talk about that. The little white man that sits on your shoulder <laughs> and checks out everything you do and say. So to knock him off. And, you know, you're free. Now I own the world. I mean, I can write about anything to anyone, for anyone. I don't have to have this white judgmental eye checking me, editing me, approving of me.